and welcome my new subbies. Thank you so much for tuning in. I am here with a update on my group swap and also to show you a presentation I did for this swap. And this idea I got from one of my YouTubers that I follow. I just love all her creativity. Her name is Yenny Storytell. That's Y-E-N-N-Y Storytell. I will leave her link below. I got this idea from her and I put a different twist on it. She um, took a Starbucks um, cup holder, you know, the sleeve, and she created um, a pocket and just put some goodies in it. So I put a twist on it and I call it a envelope holder, okay? A stuffed envelope holder. And I did this for my ladies that are in my embellishment group swap this month. And I think they turned out beautifully. Here's my twist on this. And all I did was recycle my envelopes that I had and stuff the goodies in. And I put my name. And ladies, I wanted to ask you um, to put your name on your embellishments that you're sending in. This way, when the ladies are doing a review, they'll know who it's from. So this is one. And everything that... I used was recycle like it was recycling craft paper that I had in my um, scrap stash these were all um, embellishments that were gifted to me these were from those swatches from Ace from their paint store like I told you a whole bunch and I just punched up some flowers and this is one of them here is a other one I created I think they're absolutely, you can use this to send friend mail, um, grant a wish. I mean, how stinking cute is that? And like I said, I just called it a envelope sleeve, envelope pocket, you know? And here is another one. I think they came out adorable. This is, here's one. And here's one. And it is all from the Starbucks coffee sleeve. And like I said, she has a video on how she did it. All she did was um, seal it, put some lace and paper, and she just stuffed the pocket where I used an envelope to put my embellishments. Now I'm going to show you what I'm sending the ladies. As you know, I'm going to be sending you all one of these where you can either put your embellishments on when you're crafting or even your nail. So that is one. When you send something like this, this counts as one item instead of two. So this is how I do my group swap. And another thing I want to say, I don't want any paper. That means no paper flowers, no paper nothing no stickers nothing like that no paper of any kind now if you happen to send, like myself right here i did send you guys each 10 of my die cut from the uh, tassels and it is paper but i'm not counting it as an embellishment i'm counting it just sending it as an extra and the reason why i'm doing that is because i want you guys to use your quilting tool that i sent you guys last month so there's like 10 cutouts here in different patterns and you can use your quilting tool but it's not counting as one of my embellishments and I got these little deers these wooden bold cages some purse charms here and then some of these little gold ribbon fasteners or you can put a pearl in it and use it as an embellishment and then these bunnies these felt bunnies And then, of course, you're getting the dish. So, again, um, I know Mandy's Place is hosting her a group embellishment swap as well. She has her rules. I have mine. And um, I guess, apparently, um, you know, she's going to make hers very simple. So, the cost isn't as much. I send mine back in a medium-sized black envelope. Due to all the ladies presentation and I love that that's one thing I love about my group swap so therefore I do ask for a medium flat rate envelope 
you know what I'm saying? Because that's that's the fun of it. So I enjoy that. That's what I like to do with my group swap and that's okay. If you guys can't afford to join that, I can understand that. You know, but I love it. So far I've had the same ladies that have repeatedly joined, so it's working. And I want to thank those ladies for all your support. Now, I'll be posting another video on the new the one for August. But this month, I'm going to put a twist on it, ladies. So be prepared. All right? And again, I want to give you guys a look on that. And look at how, oops, sorry. Look how simple that was. And as you can see, I can just stick the envelope in there. Or you can just use this and stick goodies in it. And that's what she did. She use that but I wanted to do something different and that's why I did that and I think for recycling repurposing something it came out and I like the idea that it's called a envelope pocket very very cute thank you so much for watching and if you have any questions please let me know and also I will leave the lady that I got her idea in my description box please show her some love and support thank you